Good morning, Dr. Phil here. Today we will be discussing on Antonox. Introduction Antonox consists of 50% oxygen and 50% nitrous oxide. Antonox is prepared by bubbling oxygen through liquid nitrous oxide. The cylinders are colored blue with blue white quartered shoulders. They are supplied at a pressure of 137 bar. Uses of Antonox Antonox is used for analgesia in labor, change of dressings, and minor procedures. Contraindications for Antonox Avoid Antonox in cases where the disadvantages or adverse effects of nitrous oxide is to be avoided. Refer to the disadvantages of nitrous oxide mind map for further details. Pseudocritical temperature Critical temperature is the temperature above which a gas cannot be liquefied, however much pressure is applied. Critical pressure is the minimum pressure that causes liquefaction of a gas at a critical temperature. Critical temperature of oxygen is negative 118.6 degrees Celsius, and critical temperature of nitrous oxide is 36.5 degrees Celsius. Pseudocritical temperature is the temperature at which the gas mixture separates into its component parts. For an antonox cylinder at 137 bar, this is negative 7 degrees Celsius, and for an antonox pipeline at 4 bar, it is negative 30 degrees Celsius. Antonox cylinders must be stored above the pseudocritical temperature of negative 7 degrees Celsius, or else nitrous oxide will liquefy. As the gases separate, Initially, an oxygen-rich mixture will be delivered, followed by a dangerous nitrous oxide-rich gas which is low in oxygen. To avoid delivering possible hypoxic gas mixtures, warm the cylinder or ensure thorough mixing of the contents of the gas cylinder. What happens if the cylinder is stored at negative 10 degrees Celsius? The gases will separate. Initially, a high concentration of oxygen is delivered followed by a high concentration of nitrous oxide. This leads to a supply of hypoxic mixture with less than 20% oxygen as the cylinder is nearly empty. To avoid delivering possible hypoxic gas mixture, warm the cylinder or ensure thorough mixing of the contents. This reverses the separation and liquefaction. Large antonox cylinders are equipped with a dip tube with its tip ending in the liquid phase. This results in the liquid being used first preventing the delivery of an oxygen concentration of less than 20%. Pointing effect This effect describes the process of dissolving oxygen in nitrous oxide liquid. The gaseous oxygen is bubbled through the liquid nitrous oxide. Liquid nitrous oxide vaporizes to form a gaseous oxygen nitrous oxide mixture. This is called the pointing effect. The critical temperature and pressure of a gas may be affected when it is mixed with another gas. The critical temperature and critical pressure of the gas mixture changes as two or more gases are mixed. Refer to the pseudocritical temperature section for more details. What are the precautions that should be taken during storage of an antonox cylinder? It should be stored horizontally to maximize the surface area of liquid phase for diffusion. Antonox cylinders should be stored at a temperature above 5 degrees Celsius for 24 hours before use. Alternatively, the cylinder can be used before 24 hours by repeated inversion. Two-stage pressure demand Antonox regulator valve. This is a two-stage pressure demand regulator valve. The first stage involves a pressure reducing valve. Second stage, a demand valve which allows gas flow when the pressure is reduced below atmospheric level. What advice would you give for its use during labor? Antonox takes about 30 seconds to act. Its analgesic effect lasts for 60 seconds after discontinuing. The mother should inhale when the uterine contraction begins to ensure the peak effect at the height of contraction. These are my references. Thank you.